was thinking about getting one of these um, while I was in a metal wallet. I guess that's what they call it. I don't even know. It's, um, it's these little, like, snap wallets. They're kind of hard. They kind of look like old tin cigarette cases. But you open them up and they will have inside pockets for change and cash and um, cards. They had them for five and I thought if I got the red one it would go with that. But I didn't because the glitter on it was coming off and it was getting on my hand. I'm like, but uh. Come on now. There we go. There we go. Put a metal tin. I remember when kids' toys used to actually come with that. So you can sit there and look at yourself. This ain't a real mirror. <laughs> anyway, this is La Vida Loca, which is their version of La Vida. Uh, Viva La Juicy by the Juicy Couture people. I believe if you like, because they, you know, give you these little sandies, these little insert scenties. I believe if you like how it smells, kind of scared me there. It was kind of wet. I thought it was wet, but it's actually cold. It's cold in my room. But, uh, if you're somebody who actually likes, you know, these little inserts that come in them, you know, the smell, maybe, uh, Viva La Juicy, you get that little smell. Ooh, that smells good. Find one of these knockoffs. One of these, um, yeah, one of these knockoffs. Find one of them, because that way, you use it all you want. And then, and then if you get maybe like the actual thing say you buy yourself this for like the actual juicy uh, Viva La Juicy for uh, Christmas you can say well I got this if I want to you know use it some other time <laughs> so anyway I'm gonna I gotta figure out where to put all this <laughs> Pile it all in there. I love that smell. It's, I think it's, some people say it's a girly smell. I don't care. I like just how it smells. Anyway, this is the body wash, shower gel, lotion thing. Oh, yeah. There was this little girl. I guess she was about seven or eight. And there, and she was loud. She wasn't, like, screaming. She was just, like, a loud talker. And I didn't. At first, I heard her talking. I'm like, okay, maybe she can't hear. You know, maybe that's why she's talking loud. She can't hear. Or maybe the people she with can hear. You know, maybe they're hard to hear. Maybe she with grandma. She got grandma man get in. Grandma man get this. But no. And this little girl. Seriously, there was. I couldn't have put up with that. This little girl. We just came in the door. Uh, we were going past all these little displays. And I heard this little girl saying, You see this right here, Mama? You see this shit? I don't want this shit. I want this shit. This is crap, Mama. Don't give me that bowl about you can't afford it. You can afford that shit, Mama. I'm going to be going, Oh my God. Sorry for all that swearing, but that's what she said. And I'm like, Oh my God, who talking like that? I'm thinking, okay, maybe a teenager, teenager. Well, I'm looking like a little girl, and the parents are not yelling at her. The parents are not going, you need to shut your mouth. That's what you need to do. The parents are just kind of knowing, going, well, I can't afford that, sweetie. That's $50. Man, if I ever said that to my mama, oh, my parents didn't beat me. All right. My parents did not, I was not spanked as a kid, I was not, you know, grounded or sitting in the bed without dinner. I wasn't 
treated like that. I was treated like if you did wrong, you know, mom and grandma would just kind of give you that look like they were crazy, you know. And then they would bring it up anytime you wanted something. Like, mama, can I get this toy? I remember you called me a bitch. <laughs> I have you ain't getting that now. Anyway. I heard that girl throughout the whole store. She wasn't she wasn't like the hissy fit kid, you know. I'm accustomed to little kids throwing hissy fit. Mommy I want this, mommy I want that, mommy I want that, I want that. She was like degrading her mom. Anyway, this is uh the body lotion. This is peach. I like peach. I'm in Georgia and that's an obvious smell. Open! <laughs> oh, paintbrush. There we go. One of those things that don't need to be falling off. Okay. Oh my god, it. Oh, that is good. That's a delicious. That's a good smell. Anyway, this is the Peach Body Lotion. Put that in there, wipe that off. Because <laughs> I have that OCD addiction if I put. I don't use lotion. But I use shower gel and body wash and all that stuff. But I don't use lotion. Because I get that sort of OCD where I wash my hands a lot. Yeah. I wash my hands before I go to the bathroom. And then I wash my hands after. And then I wash my hands a second time just to make sure that my hands are clean. So I got that. So I can't put lotion on me and go, uh, I gotta wash it off. So I have to use, like, perfume or something. Or use body wash that has like a lotion effect because I'll let my skin get dry. Um, this is the shower gel. This is the body scrub. What the hell is body scrub? It's glycerin. What is body scrub actually? Um, All that, and they kind of put it in this big old box. Not exactly environmentally friendly, is it? <laughs> all of this. Well, all of this. In this big ass box. Anywho. <sighs> I might have to make this part two video because I'm spending a lot of time opening it. 